Okay, and all I'm doing is I'm just putting an egg in a measuring cup, picking my favorite spice, or right now I'm actually trying all different ones. I know it says fish seasoning, but it tastes really good. Then I just mix it up, give her a good mix, make sure it's all the spice is all mixed in there well. And then I take it and I pour it into my bologna cup. Seems to be holding pretty good. All right, I have two more to go. Two more, two more. Actually doing it that way where I slice up the bologna a bit seems to work better. But then I just put it in the oven, 350. I'm gonna have to guess on time though, I don't know. Put it in the oven, 350. Don't mind my mess on the stove. My daughter was making stuff before I got here. But, uh, yeah. Guess we'll see you at the end. Alright. Well, it's been ten minutes. Let's, uh, give this a look and see how we're looking here. Um, uh, some of them are still looking kind of runny. I'll put it back in for another five five minutes ten minutes we'll see all right i'll get back to you okay well that's been an additional ten minutes oh look at them now they're all poofy and puffy definitely done now oh. And that's it. That's uh, like a poor man's breakfast. Bologna and eggs. And I just let them cool off, wrap them up individual, put them in the fridge or in the freezer. Well, all done. That, that was 20 minutes in the oven. So total 20 minute cook time, 10 minute prep time, not even, probably not even 10 minutes. But uh, yeah, and they're delicious. You add to them whatever you want. You can put onions and celery or whatever different spices. It's delicious. All right, have a good one.